Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Mr. 75 Caprice with another video. Today I have for you guys a 1975 Chevy Caprice convertible. Found this one online. Apparently a, someone selling the car or helping an elder old gentleman sell the car. So hopefully there's not no funny games with this one. It's not that far. It's about an hour and a half. But you still never know. What are we going to or what are we going to get into? So hopefully there's really a car there and there's no scam going on. So anyways, we do got the truck and trailer. He said the car didn't run, that it's been parked for a while. But got my boy shaving with me in case we need to push it back up. The trailer. And hopefully there's a car. All right, man. Time to hit the road. All right, guys, we made it out here to the destination where we're meeting up the guy that he's gonna be taking us to the old car or where the guy lives. He said it was a couple blocks away, so told him to just wait here. Just think about this, bro. You think it's a setup? Oh, man, it's looking like it, dude. Nobody's out here, no cars. Usually they have the cars in front. I don't see no. Yeah, we're in the middle of, I don't know where. A couple bolts in there. This is the address, nothing there. Not even a garage. Not even a garage. Unless you're, you mean a cruise, then it's right there. Man, these are always the risks you take when you go see cars, man, from people. You don't know where you're going or what you're gonna get yourself into. But let's just hope this guy is legit. Cause you know, we ain't playing. We ain't playing at all, never like him. All right, guys. Stay tuned. All right, guys. So we met up with the dude. He's in this black truck. We're gonna follow him to the car. Sketchy. Hoping he's not on no funny games. Oh, that's right there. And he's not. The car is right there. Alright guys, so we made out here to the car. Go check this thing out. Check it out, I'm gonna go grab their beer and get them out here. Alright. I've got some Delta hookups. Oh, looks like we got some cancer going on in these doors. No. And I just had some doors. Got rid of them. Just got some bubbling quarter. I know that I need a tail light. Yep. Got a tail hitch, put a ball, pull the boat. Carburetor there. Got the antenna. Can tell it's been sitting for a while. Yeah, it's right here though, the one you have. <laughs> hey man. Check this hood. The price is about to pop up right now. Definitely, we got spark plugs here. That's a sign of the car not running.
That model looks like it's very old. Super. Don't even look like it's got any life left. It's crazy, right? Yeah. It's an AC car. See the compressor. It looks like everything's been sitting for a while. It's a long while. Check out the inside. Ooh. Got power option though. Yeah, it's a power option car. Got the power windows, power locks. Power seats. Yep, power seats. Under the seats are ripped. Uh, they're ripped. And it smells so bad in here. So bad. Got them kind things for the mice so they don't get in. I don't even want to sit in this car. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's got a nice dash with no cracks. Pissed. 23,000 miles. Probably got like 123, maybe 223. Who knows? There's a tail light replacement for the one that's crashed. It's so dirty in here. Back seats don't look bad of a shape, but it's very rare to find one of these back seats in bad shape. The rockers don't look bad. Maybe out in a couple minutes. All right. Let's see what the floor looks like. The floor is there. Hey, grab the keys, see if you can pop the trunk. Let some air out of it. It doesn't have a key? Oh, okay. Can't even pop the trunk. So much dirt. I was cleaning one time. Yeah? Yeah, they put the motor, motor on the top's not working at the moment, I guess. And then, uh, it looks like it just, it's gonna need a motor. That motor looks pretty, pretty old. Like very, like it's probably gonna be all locked up. Does it crank or no? Oh, you don't Honestly, even know. I don't know oh, you don't know about nothing it. about it right now? Oh, okay. Um, they don't have the trunk key that you know of? Yeah, they should. They had it open the other day. Uh, let's check the underneath. Looks like the floors are all there. Don't see what you're talking about. This is Dell. Guys, this was a tough, tough deal. It just happened. Um, but you made it happen you know dealing talking to old people it's just it just gets hard you know and you know it's hard for them to let go of stuff so with that being said the 75 caprice going back with us yeah it's on the rough side a little bit need some got some bubbling here and there but it's all complete it's all original and the missing parts are all in there so I don't think it was a bad purchase. You can't even find these cars nowhere right now. So let's just see what happens with this one. Drop it off at that mechanic, see if he can get it running. Got some Delta wheels, both gotta go. Anyways, time to hit the road. It's getting dark out here. Make sure y'all get in the comment section. Let me know what you guys think about this 1975 Caprice convertible. Is that a good purchase or not? Don't forget to like and share this video. Subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell.